Hi there, I'm Nick. I'm the Artistic Director for Wassail Theatre Company and I'm here to tell you about our next show, Apples and Angels, which opens on the 8th of September, finishes on the 30th of September. Now you might see behind me, we've got the um, actors and the director and the uh, part of the team who are putting the show together. We're just um, at the beginning of the second week of rehearsals um, and we're reading through the script and about to start the blocking process. Um, so, yeah, I just want to let you know about it, really, and make sure that you feel like you have the opportunity to come and see it. Uh, the show's free. Um, you do need to book tickets, and you can find a link to the uh, to where to book tickets on our website, wassailtheatre.co.uk. The show is a promenade show, uh, and it's open air. It's outdoors. And we're doing it here, in and around the orchards of Burrow Hill. Uh, I'm just going to see if I can. Oh, no, I don't know if I can. Okay, so I'll just take you for a quick little walk, show you the hill, uh, maybe tell you a little bit about the show. So um, the story follows Pete Steele who is a character that we've been telling the stories of for the last few years. Um, and his estranged wife, Babs. Estranged maybe is the wrong word, but basically they got married two years ago. And on their wedding day, they got separated. They haven't seen each other since. Um, and so today is the day, unbeknownst to them, that maybe they will find each other. I don't want to give too much away. Uh, so you can see we're working in Borough Hill, Cider Orchard. Um, this is Borough Hill behind me. This is a sycamore tree on top of a um, conical hill in Kingsbury Episcopi um, in South Somerset. And well, it's a really beautiful space, um, and it's an important space. It's a space of magic, and it's a space of healing. So Pete and Babs, our two protagonists, they are on a journey separate journey that crosses the same path to reconnect with themselves, reconnect with the community that they belong to, reconnect with each other. Um, and they have been brought, guided to this space in order for the healing process to take place. So, whoops. I'm just walking up the hill at the moment. Just to give you a flavour of where we'll be going. We might not be going exactly this way. Uh, we don't know yet. Um, whatever we do, we're going to make the show as, as accessible as we possibly can. Um, there's some people up here as well, uh, going for walks, and that's the beautiful thing about this place, is the great good. Love to come and have a walk, bring the dogs, take in the view. So, if I come here, uh, just in the background, just there, above my, felt, my finger, you can see the actors. So yeah, Apples and Angels, it's on in September, uh, tickets are free, but you do need a ticket, um, 
in order to experience the show. They start Tuesdays to Fridays. They start at 6 p.m. The performances. Saturdays they start at 2 p.m. Um, and there's a map to give you directions. Whoa! <laughs> uh, to give you directions to where the show is taking place on our website. Um, it is a promenade show, so the audience will walk around the hill um, and we're being mindful to make it as accessible as possible, even with that in mind, um, for people who, for whom walking can be a challenge. Um, so the audience will kind of, they'll start sat down and they'll move to the next place and they'll sit and there'll be lots of opportunities and places to rest around. Uh, it's a fairy tale. It's an original, brand new, Somerset-based fairy tale that, in one way or another, draws a close to the chapter, uh, draws a close to the story that we've been telling of Pete over the last few years. Pete is salt of the Somerset earth. He's a person with a complex past um, and a lot of um, he's he's searching for forgiveness Forgi forgiveness from other people forgiveness for himself too um, you can see the apple trees around me which form our set um, and the apples are growing even though compared to last week when we started rehearsals, the apples are starting to grow, um, take on more volume and colour, and these eventually, these apples will be turned into cider um, and sold at Borough Hill Cider Farm. So, come to the show. Headlines are, come to the show. Um, enjoy some magical storytelling in the heart of Somerset. And... Stay for a cider or an apple juice after the show. <laughs> 